United States of America according to task and purpose. The Army will deploy its first platoon of laser-powered weapons next month. The Guardian weapon system, which is based on the Striker vehicle platform, comprises of a 50-kilowatt laser that can destroy drones, rockets, and mortar. Drones are being used on battlefields today, thanks to the changing face of conflict. Any country's defense expenditures may be shattered by these disposable attack tools that may be launched in hundreds or even thousands. Instead, a laser-powered energy weapon has the capacity to fire on targets quickly as well as have an inexhaustible supply of ammo. Cord Technologies and Raytheon Intelligence and Space have partnered to develop the Guardian system. The Cord Corporation, which was awarded the prize in 2019 for developing the technology, is responsible for putting the weapon on the Striker combat vehicle. Raytheon devised and constructed a 50-kilowatt laser weapon system that includes a specific radar data collection system, a targeting sensor, and a beam control mechanism. The system, on the other hand, can take down a variety of aircraft threats such as rotary wing aircraft, rockets, artillery, and mortars rather than just using unmanned aerial vehicles as its targets. Laser-based weaponry systems may be used effectively both in the air and at sea. The U.S. Army's Rapid Capabilities and Critical Technologies Office, on the other hand, wants to put the system into action at first. High-capacity batteries power the device, which may continue to charge while the striker's engines are running. This system incorporates Raytheon's defense contractor expertise as well as a training environment for cadets to get acclimated to systems and prepare for the battlefield. The initial batch of combat vehicles, which were scheduled to be delivered in September this year, took into account the results from the troops who tested the prototype. Thank you for watching.